Lou, oh, I'm the Easter Bunny. I'm so glad everyone could join us today because I have some thoughts about Easter. Um, at least Santa gets cookies. That's my thought. All right, what do I get? Temptation. That's what I get. Delicious bunnies and yummy newly hatched chicks, which symbolize the spring and my ravenous appetite. I mean, no, I, 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 I eat carrots and, and leaves and shit little pellets. Um, I'm sorry. You know what? I'm no good at this. I mean, look at me. I'm dressed like a bunny. I haven't seen rabbit ears this bad since my 1984 Zenith TV set. I'm a veteran documentarian, and here I am in an outfit made of cheap muslin and coats. I look like a reject from Project Runway. Uh, a cosplay disaster, Bob Mackie run amok. Brian Henson of Jim Henson's Creature Shop would slap the designer across the face. This is a fail. Did you say fail? Well, at least they use the Muppet fleece for the inner ear and the stomach thing. I've seen better outfits on Lady Gaga at the MTV Awards. I'd like to thank everyone who watches and contributes films to the Puppet Films Group on Facebook. Um, from Muppeteers to aspiring puppeteers to marionettists to ventriloquists, our motto is, if it's a film on YouTube, post that mofo. Honestly, some people have been posting links to shit they want to sell in our puppet films group. You know what I say, more power to you. Make it a commercial and you're on. Use puppets, sell away. Last year, I did an interview with the Easter Bunny, and some of you are wondering what happened to him. I don't want to be the one to break the bad news, but they turned them into chocolate bunnies at the at the end of the year. It's very sad. Um, they're hollow inside, like myself, emotionally. <laughs> now it's time for horrible bunny pictures with kids. Now Uncle Paul is a great makeup artist, and I think this one really gets to the point. Um, this one right there is understandable. The poor bunny just sees a carrot top. I mean, who's to blame him, right? Is this politically correct or offensive to rabbits? Listen, if Bugs Bunny gets a load of this and decides to get insulted, I'm toast. You know they call him Bugs because he's flea infested. I hope this whole thing gets through legal. That's all I can say because I don't want any problems with that rodent. Do you hear me? And finally, scariest of all, this guy. Someone please tase him. Can I get paid now? No? Oh my god, I hate this job.